friends, I hope you enjoyed listening to the book, The Very Hungry Caterpillar. Now we can make a craft to go with the book. I used sponges and watercolor to make my caterpillar. So if you have sponges at home and an adult can help you cut the sponge into a circular type shape. You might not have paint or sponges at home, but that's okay because there's many different ways you can make your caterpillar. So look at all of the ways we can make our hungry caterpillar. I use um, crowns and markers and also watercolors. Okay, so if you have crowns, markers, watercolors, what you can do is have an adult trace something circular for your circles and then you guys can do the rest and you can also use what else you can also use dot r and some play-doh and some play-doh look how cute that is she made a little caterpillar with play-doh so there's so many ways to do it so just remember if teacher lauren is making a crib and you don't have the supplies you can always improvise which means use something different to make it similar don't forget to send me pictures of your Hungry Caterpillar. Bye, friends.